Welcome to the folks learn. Today we will learn how to connect to an already existing SQL server. First, you need to add a button, a data grid view to form 1. When you click the connect button your data bind to the data grid view. We will use the category table in Northwind database to play the demo. You can download Northwind database below this video. A SQL connection object represents a unique session to a SQL server data source. With a client server database system, it is equivalent to a network connection to the server. SQL connection is used together with SQL data adapter and SQL command to increase performance when connecting to a Microsoft SQL server database. To ensure that connections are always closed, you can open the connection inside of a using block. We always use connection string in forms that we design, but when you design a big software you should set the connection string for once and use it in many forms. Every time you want to change the connection string just change the main connection string in the app config file. By this method you don't need to change all of the forms in your project, just change the connection string in the app config.
Now, we will create a stored procedure to retrieve all category, then we change the code to call the stored procedure. You can create a stored procedure with parameters. A stored procedure is a pre-compiled executable object that contains one or more SQL statements. In many cases stored procedures accept input parameters and return multiple values. Parameter values can be supplied if a stored procedure is written to accept them. Thank you for watching this video.